What's good everybody? Welcome to Life on Beagle Road. I am super excited today because one, something special has arrived and two, I scored some pretty awesome stuff. Both of which are huge surprises for Courtney. Like major, major surprises that she knows nothing about and I cannot wait to show it to her. So stay tuned. So let's talk about uh, some things that are going on here on the property. One, you all know that the goats, the does, are preggers. And I'm talking not just one, but all the goats are preggers. Maybe one isn't, but the rest, they're gonna have some babies. And of course, you remember, I've been doing all kinds of reworking inside the barn, trying to make it just a little bit easier for us to get some things done. Except when I tore it all apart, I never put the kidding stalls back. And of course, Courtney says to me, hey, Kenny, um, all these goats are pregnant, so those kidding stalls need in like now. That's at the same time that I'm still trying to finish that chicken coop down there. That's still got a lot of work to go, and I'm not sure when I'm getting back to the barn. So when we were at the Homesteaders of America conference, I saw something that I think it's gonna make my life easier. Now one of the things that I was gonna do with those kidding stalls was make them sort of a, a breakdown, break up, whatever you wanna call it, knockdown stalls, you know? Like, get them up, make them configurable so they're not all fixed in one sort of configuration, but be able to put them any way I wanted. That was really important. Started to do the math, it was gonna add up pretty fast, and it was gonna take a lot of time. Once we were at the conference, I went over to the Premier One tent and I saw something pretty fantastic. They had that exact same thing already there. No joke. So once I priced everything up, figured out how long it was gonna take, I decided we needed those suckers. They need to be in our barn because sometimes time equity is worth more than maybe what you're gonna pay for something. So here they are, folks. These are our new kidding stalls. They are made of aluminum and they are literally knockdown stalls. They fold up against the wall. This is gonna be amazing. Amazing. So excited. My setup time is gonna be so fast. I don't even know what to say. But what's the second thing? Thank you for asking. See all this lumber right here? That, folks is going to go up on the walls of our barn. Yep, I'm gonna shiplap the barn. I got a huge, huge score on this pine. It's 12 inch by 14 and 16 feet. Ah, can you believe that? Super cheap. I probably paid eh, maybe seven or eight dollars a board. Super, you're not gonna find something cheaper than that. To top it off, it's already shiplapped for me. I don't need to do it. All I need to do is put it in the barn, cut it up, get everything on the walls, boom! We're gonna have the sexiest barn this side of Pennsylvania, because I haven't seen a lot of barns. So I don't know if it's that sexy, but I think it's gonna be sexy. I am excited! But now we need to find Courtney, because we gotta surprise her. She knows nothing about it, and it just came. Baby, Courtney! Hey! What? Can you come out front? Bridget and I are playing blocks. I know, and that's really important. Okay. And I think it's amazing that you're playing blocks, right? Are you having fun, Bridgie, playing blocks? Yeah. Don't you think we should go see a surprise for Mama? Oh, a surprise? Daddy's got a big surprise. Do you want to see? Yeah. Come on, let's go. Okay, let's go. Come on, Mama. I don't know where she's going. All right, Courtney, before I show you the surprise, there's a, a couple things that I, I wanna make sure I talk to you about. One, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to build those kidding stalls in time. Yeah, I'm sorry. There's just so much work to do. Like, do we really need them? 
Bill? What do you mean, do we really need them? Where am I gonna put baby goats, Kenny? Do you want them in the house? Do you wanna stay in the barn and I'll bring the goats in the house to have their babies? Cause I'm... if that's what you want, that's fine, I'll do that. I mean, those are all options. I just don't think that those are good options along with me building them. That's, that's all I'm saying. Wait, what? Just, I wanted you to know that. That's all. Here, come on, I'll, I'll show you. I'm sure I'm gonna be real thrilled about this surprise while you just- Well, me you know, I, I just thought like I should prepare you a little bit because I just, I just, I'm not gonna have enough time. You know what I mean? So what I did was instead is, um, I just got you these boxes. Is this another project that you're starting when other stuff isn't finished? All right, well, it's, okay, that's not fair, but yes, it is definitely <laughs> another project before that gets finished. Do you wanna know what it is? It, sure. Do you remember the uh, premiere one tent we went to? Yes. Do you remember the aluminum primagates? Yes. That you thought were pretty cool? Yes. That's what this is! You bought them? Yeah. How many did you buy? This is a lot of boxes. It, it is. Um, well, it was one of those things where I was like, not really sure how many I needed. So I probably overbought to make sure I had enough. So I can have more baby goats? No, that is not what that means. Uh, I think that's what That's it means. not what that means. Let's open these, Bridgie. Spider! Come on, Bridgie. Mama, go smash the spider! I'm not smashing the spider. The spider's fine. Also, that's an ant. Come on, open it up. Let's well, see it. I need like a knife or something. Do you have fingernails? Mama. Not to do that. Me, They're not like. <laughs> no, I'll take the stickers off them. All right. I'll take the stickers. Maybe, maybe you can get a knife. Don't push it off there, Bridge. No, my key works. Oh so well. Well, I was cutting the cardboard. Good job, Bridget. Way to tear that paper off of there. Yeah, Come on, you should be opening this up like it was Christmas Day. I'm trying. You getting that paper, B? Good work. There you go. Get that out of there. Get it out. Get it out. Wow. Pull the box, Bridgie. Woo -hoo! I won it. Oh my gosh. I'm like a real goat farmer. Do you love it? Do you love it? I love it. But wait, folks, there's more. There's more? What is it? So, the, Thanks, um, remember I said I was gonna, I was gonna put all that wood on this, the barn? Like yeah. I was gonna put plywood up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then we'll paint it and whatever. Right, yeah. Yeah, so, I changed my mind. I don't really wanna do that either. Is this another trick? This is totally another trick. Come <laughs> here, set that down. I know but you're excited. I wanna put it together. No, not right now. Just put it put it down. You you'll get to it. We'll get to it. Alright, come on. Come on. Close your eyes a little bit and hold my hand. Okay? You good? Close your are your eyes closed? My eyes are closed. Okay, keep them closed. Don't run me into anything. I will not run you into anything, I promise. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. That's just the truck. Come on. Don't run into the mirror. All right, so keep your eyes closed. Okay. okay, I'm gonna turn you a little bit. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit, okay, stop. Okay. Did Look, you replace the don't... garage door I ran into? I did not replace the garage door you ran into, oh. no. Okay. Here's what I want you to do, I want you to put your head down, but don't open your eyes yet. Just wanna get you, okay, now. You ready? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Open your eyes. It's the wood. <gasps> Whoa. 
Wait, are you shiplapping the inside of the barn for me? Yes, I am. I'm moving to the barn. This is amazing. Do you love it? I do love it. Aren't they so wide? They are. Huge. Oh my gosh. Let's go set it up. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Bridget, don't knock the dog with that. Well, folks, sorry. This is just kind of like a whim video. I was just really excited and I wanted to get this out to you. Mainly, I wanted to surprise Courtney. And if I didn't do it now, I would have had to fake it. And nobody wants to see a fake video about surprises, right? So. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned because yes, I am still going to have to put all this up, which will happen apparently in the next day or so. And yes, I will still get that stinking chicken coop done. So have a great day, folks. Thanks for hanging out with us. Don't forget me. Are you gonna say anything? Yes. All right, get out of here. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, give us a thumbs up or all that jazz. You know what you're supposed to do. Do the YouTube thing. See you on the next one.